This morning at the Coffee County Commission meeting, the Elba High golf team was recognized for its latest accomplishment. A new chapter was written in the history books when the Elba High School boys golf team claimed the first state golf title for the Tigers. The boys came out on top in Mobile to claim the Class 1A and 2A state championship. And I picked him up and we all started jumping and people started yelling and it was fun. It was a party in the clubhouse when the team found out it had made history. The underdog shot 313 to come out on top over expected winner Brantley, whose team shot a 320. We were all really confident going into the year, maybe a little doubts, but I really didn't expect much less from this team. Every guy on the team is at least a tri-sport athlete. This spring, every member had to practice golf on top of baseball practices. It kind of brings you close, you know, and working out in the weight room with them and, and running miles and everything, you know, it just kind of brings like a, a brotherhood to it. Members of the team say they would hit on mats at home every night. They have to find time to practice. I have to find time to practice with them around our busy schedules. Without their work ethic, it, it, this wouldn't be accomplishable. Wilson, the lone senior on the team, also claimed the individual state title shooting two under par. Another first for the Tigers. I feel really blessed to be able to do that, but you know, the team goal was kind of really what we all went in there, and I'm just blessed that the individual kind of came along with it. That team centered mindset was the key to success for the Tigers. We all wanted it worse for the guy beside us than we did for ourselves. The team gave credit to coach Mark Wicker, who taught them to play a more conservative style of golf. While they didn't always like this style, they admit it paid off for them in the end.